George Spear was born in Melrose, Massachusetts in 1908. As a young child, she had a cousin who also loved to write. At family gatherings, they would read each other their latest stories. This practice continued throughout their college years. In 1930, Spear received a BA from Smith College. Then she attained a master's from Boston University. She later taught at private high schools. In 1936, she married Alden Spear and moved to Connecticut where she had two children. In 1957, Spear published her first book, Calico Captive. Spear's novel, Calico Captive, was inspired by a journal she found written by Suzanne Johnson, dated in 1807. The diary told the story of Johnson's family's kidnapping by Indians. In 1958, Spear published her second novel, The Witch of Blackbird Pond. In 1959, The Witch of Blackbird Pond won Elizabeth Spear her first Newbery Award. In 1961, Spear published her third book, The Bronze Bow. The Bronze Bow was her first book which was not about colonial America. It took place in Judea in the time of Jesus. Spear won her second Newbery Award for this amazing novel. In a famous acceptance speech for one of her Newbery medals, Spear said, quote, I believe that all of us who are concerned with children are committed to the salvaging of love, honor, and duty. In 1962, Spear published her final novel, The Sign of the Beaver, which won many awards including the Christopher Award, Scott O'Dell Award, and the Laura Ingalls Wilders Award in the, in, for her contributions to Children's Book Society. In 1994, Spear died of an aneurysm in Tucson, Arizona on November 15th. Spear was a great American author who will be remembered by generations to come.